and it is a Recollections bland, bland, brand stamp cleaner pad. And it was a total gamble on my part, but um, I absolutely love it. It was so worth it. It was $9.99. I used a 40% off coupon, so it was about $6. Um, it closes up really nice. I was really impressed with, and as you can see, I've already been using it, and I've already washed it once. I'm really impressed with the pad. It has like this foam uh, bottom, and then this is kind of like a soft bristle. And so you can either soak it in stamp cleaner or in water. And I used um, water. And then when you're when you've stamped, your stamp is inked up. All you have to do is brush it across the bristles and clean stamp. This is a dye ink, so it wasn't the best one to let me get a pig or one of my other ints inks. All right, so I have an oxide here. Um, this will wash off better. The dye inks don't wash off quite as well. And it's blue, so you'll be able to see it a little bit better. All right, so I've inked it up. And then I've stamped off screen. And then, as you can see, the blue is coming off a little bit and clean stamp. So, no more blue. Super easy. You can close it up. It stays wet, I would say, for mm, several days before you have to re-wet it. I like, too, that it doesn't really seem to um, smell. I tried the Lawn Fawn Stamp Chamois. Um, I bought that after Christmas, and I was really disappointed in it. Um, baby wipes work far better, in my opinion. I would either it dried out super fast, and I had to keep wetting it, or I would put it in a container and it would stink. I finally had to throw it out because it grew moldy and I just used baby wipes, which baby wipes work great, but they do dry out too. And I did, do go through a lot of them. So this is reusable and it's great. So you might want to go to Michael's and check it out. If you do a lot of stamping, it slips in really easy where you're working in a deck desk space. And, um, so yeah, just my little tip. I didn't, you know, mean to stumble across something that would help me so much, but this is one of my favorite tools for stamping now. So I thought I would just share it with you.